Hey guys, October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month, which is just around the corner. And as many of you know, I'm working with the Warriors in Pink this year to help increase awareness for breast health. Today I'm gonna to share with you five fit tips to help you reduce your chances of having breast cancer and also ways to just stay healthy overall and cancer free. Tip number one, women who exercise four or more hours a week have a 10 to 30% less likely risk of developing breast cancer. Now doctors aren't sure exactly why this is, but one theory is that exercise helps break down estrogen, which has been linked to potentially causing cancer. Tip number two, obesity increases your risk of developing breast cancer, especially after menopause. Now make life easier for yourself and just maintain a healthy body weight throughout life so that when you are older and you are going through menopause, you're not freaking out because now you really wanna lose the weight because you wanna reduce your risk of breast cancer. Tip number three, to reduce your risk of breast cancer, eat a diet high in carotenoids. This includes foods that are a vibrant orange like sweet potatoes or carrots, also salmon, kale, spinach, and tomatoes. Eating a diet rich in this nutrient can reduce your risk of breast cancer by as much as 50% according to a research a study done by Harvard University and Brigham and Women's. Tip number four is to check your breasts. Now, we all forget to do this. That's why October Breast Cancer Awareness Month is so important. We are reminding you to do this on a regular basis. Things to look for when you're checking your breasts are for little marble-sized mass that moves when you touch it. Also, if your breasts are red and swollen and tender. You also wanna look to see if you have irregular discharge from your nipples, a stabbing pain in your breast that doesn't go away. You know, if you move your arm different ways, it could just be that you're sore from a chest workout, but be conscious, know your body, check your breasts, and encourage family and friends to do the same for Breast Cancer Awareness Month. And my last tip, number five, is to spread the word. Uh, October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month. A lot of people don't know this, and you guys watching probably are within this age group, but 70,000 men and women uh, this year in the U.S. are going to be diagnosed with cancer between the ages of 15 and 39. Now, among women, breast cancer is the most common cancer in that age group. What's hard if you're diagnosed in this age group with breast cancer is that it tends to be more aggressive. Each year, 1,200 women in the US die from breast cancer under the age of 40. So I'm encouraging you guys to spread the word, wear some breast cancer awareness apparel this month. You can get your own t-shirt, sweatshirt at fordcares.com from the Warriors in Pink. This is a tank that I'm wearing. 60% of people say that they are more likely to think about their own breast health when they see someone else wearing a breast cancer awareness t-shirt, um, umbrella, whatever. So do your part, spread the message. Let me know down below if you've been impacted by breast cancer and what you're doing to help share the word this October. I'll see you guys soon.